I loved playing computer games. I had been playing them since the age of seven. Since then, playing computer games had become my hobby. I played games on various websites day and night. I tried at least 30 different games each day. I did that as I got bored of a game after I played it once or twice. I used to sleep at 3.15am and wake up at 8.50am. My parents were unaware of what I did as I used to turn off the lights and play the computer games. I could not concentrate in class and used to fall asleep in class. My teacher used to scold me every day. My favorite game then was Restaurant City. Restaurant City is a game where you own a restaurant and you need to make sure your customers are happy so you can increase to your new level. I like it when my friends send me ingredients so I can make new dishes. My eyes turned red and sore. I was unable to see things properly and clearly. The next day, I missed the school bus. I got late for school and my teacher reprimanded me. When I went home that day, my parents shouted at me for getting late for school. I was even grounded for a week. My parents didn't say I could not use the computer. The next day, I did not go to school as I did not wake up until 10.40 a.m. At 11 a.m., I started using the computer. I played Russian City until 11.45 a.m. At 11.45 a.m., I quickly took a bath and ate my lunch. While eating lunch, I continued to use the computer. When I finished eating lunch, I went to the living room to watch television. I left my plate in the room and my computer switched on. My mother went to the room to pick up the plate and utensils and saw the game on the screen. She was shocked to see that I was on level 201 on Restaurant City. When Dad came home, Mom told him how addicted I was to computer games and told him to send me for counselling every day. The first day I went for counselling, I was very nervous about who my counsellor would be and how she would look like, but she turned out to be very nice. My counsel, Mrs. Kavita, taught me how to spend my time doing other things. I used to go to Mrs. Kavita's house every day after school. Whenever I was there, I used to learn new things every time. My results were getting better. I was improving my studies and everyone was happy with that. I learned how to manage my time for all my things. I even made a timetable. My addiction ended all thanks to Mrs. Kavita. She helped me quit this bad habit. I am very thankful to her.